about um Rema. You guys know Rema. Baby, come down. Come down. I love your body, body all day from lockdown. Oh lockdown. Oh lockdown. Be you swear like Wandao. Hey, Wandao. Ah, that sounds too bad. So yeah, Rema, he's um officially left his record label, Mavens. You know, Mavens, um, the record label out of Nigeria is ran by Don Jazzy in yeah, so he's he's left it. He's left the stable. Um, I don't know where he's going. But yeah, so this this lady's got the story for us. Her channel is uh Tav TV, T H A V T V. You guys go subscribe to her and like her video. So she's gonna let us know what's popping, what's going on, um, why did he leave or what's the vibes? Shout out. This. So like I said earlier, we're going to be talking about Rema leaving the Mavens record. So Rema cleared everything on his Instagram concerning the Mavens record and Jonesy World. Any Jonesy World related content, he cleared everything off his Instagram. And fans have already started pouring in congratulations, congratulating Rema for his huge success. Of course, he's big enough to do it. Rema is big. There's this thing they say that when you are big, you are big and you have to admit it. There's moving forward this part of life, Abby. But some fans have... <laughs> Abby? Rema's big or no? Rema's huge. Like, he's got a smash... He had a smash hit. Like, Calm Down was a smash hit. Didn't... What's her name? Selena Gomez hopped on it. That she was on the charts for a minute so yeah I'm, he has another song i can't think of the other song i'm not a fan like that uh but he's a big deal other opinions they're like why did he leave he would have calmed down that so many people that left the maybe record that they're not doing well and people are not hearing of them like corey de bello and some of them but we must remember that corey de bello admitted that he had to pause music for some time because he had other things he had to concentrate on so it's not because he left the Mavens record that made him the way he is or that made him not to be so, you know, relevant online and in the music industry like that. Okay, so it was in 2019, March 2019, that Don Jazzy announced that Rema has joined, that Rema has joined the Mavens record. And it was, it was a very beautiful one. He announced that he met, he met Rema and even Ayasta on Instagram. That is to tell you that if you're talented, continue to post your content. One day you can never tell. I mean, to Don Jazzy. Don Jazzy has really, really tried in finding young and beautiful talents. He has done so much. He has done so well in helping young people develop their talents, make them known, make them gain a lot from their talents. And he's really trying. It's not even just for musicians, so skip the cars, you know. Once he sees that you're doing something, you're young, you're beautiful, you're smart, you're doing something and you're putting in that effort, he goes in to push you. You know, he just yeah. humbles himself and brings himself down to help you. So my people telling So Arya Star, she's also signed to Mavens. So Don Jazzy, he he, he unearthed her. He's 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 pretty he's like he's he's a big deal back at home in Niger. He'd be doing sh there is something called growth in life you will grow you you cannot always continue to be at a particular place okay look at Tiwa Savage Tiwa Savage was once among the Mavens record you and she's been amazing for herself I love Tiwa Savage oh my god Tiwa Savage is like Tiwa Savage was like my first African crush you know like oh when I saw Tiwa Savage and her music is a dope Shut up. You, you cannot deny the fact that Tiwa Savage ever since she left, if, if not better herself, I'm sure she has even done better after she left the record. We cannot deny the fact that, that Tiwa Savage herself left the Mavis record and she is doing amazingly well. So why would Rema not do well? Like, Oh, she also left. Where did Tiwa go? Tiwa, Tiwa Savage record label. Hmm. Tiwa Savage. Capital, Motown Records, Universal. Okay. Okay. Let's get back. Like we're talking about Rema. We are talking about Rema. Like Rema has gone international. He has gone far. He has done so amazing for himself. He has gotten to the level where he can finally leave the Mavens record if he wants to. So he collect all content relating to the Mavens record and Jonesy World related content, like every single thing like that. So he's free to do whatever he wants by him, on his own. He's free to do his music however he wants, whichever way he wants. He's free to earn from his music whichever way he wants without the contribution of the Mavens record or Jonesy World, whatever. He's free to do anything without their contribution or without their, you know, their opinions or whatever. He's free to do his music however he wants. And he needs it all. money from it however he wants, of course. And for me, I feel like it's a good news so it's really it's a really, really amazing news for him to go of course he will succeed it's it's wonderful for him to be able to move forward like this so the thing is if you're meant to go far you go far if you're big you're big whether under the mavens record or outside the mavens record but people saying oh don't leave if you leave you might not be you might not be as big as you are now there are people that left and they didn't do well the truth is i believe that if they left and they didn't do well they were they weren't even going to do well even if they were still under the mavens record so if you are big you are big if you are talented you are talented if you have grace you have grace so with or without the mavens record i believe that rema has everything it takes to be big i believe that rema has everything it takes to continue being amazing and because of don jazzy he's doing so well in the lives of young and talented artists like he has been so amazing he has been he has just been trying everything possible to bring out young talent for the world to see and we will not deny that fact we will continue to appreciate don jazzy all right my you thank you thank you my sister thank you my sister thank you okay so she pretty much broke it down for us they signed in 2019 uh along with all the other stars 
uh, Arya Star, <laughs> ironic, all of that, all of them people, the stable people, Teo Savage, all the people there. And then, yeah, so they, there wasn't actually a reason as to why he left. There isn't, doesn't seem like there's any animosity or something, but from what she described, I guess, it was just time to, to leave the nest, which is dope, which is dope. Um, so yeah, shout out to Rema. We'll see where he's going to go, what he's going to fish for. I'm sure niggas go, the labels are ready to snatch him up with that label claws, you know, that ready thing. Oh. Um, yeah, but it's interesting. It's interesting that he, he signed in 2019 and it's 2024. I mean, okay, four-year deal. I feel like, I feel like, hmm, I wonder, does he still owe some albums? Did he fulfill the deal? That's the question. That's the question, though, because if he, in 2019, I mean, you're probably signing, let's be honest, he's probably signed for like a, maybe a three to five album deal. You know, if we're speculating, and if you're dropping an album every year and a half, I don't know how many albums Rama has, but I don't think Rama has three albums, does he? I don't know. I don't know. You guys coming down, correct me if I'm wrong. But yeah, so I'm just I'm just wondering whether he completed this deal. You know, if he did, that's great. Thank God. If not, you know, legal papers gonna come his way, especially if he's trying to go to a different label. But anyway, cool. That's that was the story. Shout out to the tv and the great lady who broke it down for us all right cool let's move on bow